Well, today we are celebrating a uh, ribbon cutting ceremony of our expansion of our Book Nook door. A few months ago we were in a 600 square feet and now we've been able to span next door into a bigger location. Uh, for a long time we've been in the 600 square feet next door, the Book Nook. We had a desire in order to expand because uh, we had a lot of product and a lot of merchandise that we weren't able to display and then also we had a desire to make it more of a community a location where people can come and connect. So as we were looking around and thinking about it, this next door location opened up um, and which was really a good thing for us because if it didn't, we would probably have to move from downtown uh, Papillion. We love downtown Papillion. So it just kind of worked out. If you haven't been down here, it's a beautiful location. Uh, it used to be a bank and it's got a lot of history to it. Deron and Brittany, we just wanted to say on behalf of the Mayor and City Council, first off, that we are so grateful that you chose Papillion to start your first location for the Book Nook, and we're so excited that you have been able to grow across our metro area. One thing that has been amazing is you guys truly have been key in helping create a sense of community within our downtown business district. And we're just so excited to that you have the new location, that you've been able to expand, and that you have chosen to stay in Papillion throughout the year. So thank you so much. If you come into the new book nook, um, you first thing you'll see is the space that's available. I mean, there's a lot more comfortable and sitting space that we didn't have in our other store. Also, in the new store, you will have the whole downstairs is a board game cafe, which we open up for people to rent board games. Then also, we have a movie room downstairs where you can go and you can buy thousands of thousands of and pick through thousands of thousands of movies and board games in the, in the downstairs. It's amazing where we went from our smallest bookstore to our biggest now in downtown Papillion. So there are thousands of books upstairs. A lot of really cool place in order to hang and bring the family. We are wanting to make this into more of a community engagement location. You'll find out that it's not just the normal bookstore. There's puzzle clubs on Monday night. You'll find out there we're going to be do, uh, starting a yoga class. We're going to be doing a lot of children's reading times and a lot of different things that are a little off the wall for a bookstore just so that we can get some community into the, the store. We're really excited because now where we have always had this desire to have that space for people to come in and connect. It won't be the normal bookstore when you walk in. Plus, uh, it's, a, it, it's a phenomenal, amazing building. Really, really grateful for the uh, owners that allowed us to come in and make this place home for us. Everybody knows we were in the smaller 600 square feet location and this one just happened to open up for us. And so it allows us to do a lot more in downtown Papillion and uh, make it more of a community space, not just a bookstore. So we're real excited. Uh, looking forward to cutting this ribbon and uh, mm -hmm. have a lot of people come in and uh, see what's all new for the Nook. I just wanted to say thank you to everybody that are in Papillion that have been so much of a support for us, the mayor and every, the, the entire city. The way that they've embraced the bookstore uh, made it a lot easier in order to uh, fulfill and build our dream here in downtown Papillion. And uh, like I said, it makes us, I mean, we feel like we're at home. So thank you Papillion and thank you for such a great support. Yeah!